Jeff Jacobs, and I'm the creator of Reno's Neon Line District, which comes to life as the sun goes down. This is about a half a mile for people to walk up and down the center of our district and enjoy sculptures from Burning Man, tributes to the old motels, restaurants, and casinos that were in downtown Reno 40, 50 years ago. We're creating a new heartbeat for downtown. Erica Wisnowski. I'm the volunteer coordinator for Fly Ranch. Fly Ranch is 3,800 acres. This land was all indigenous. Much of the land around us still is. So what makes Fly Geyser unique is that it's different every time you see it. The geyser maintains a pretty steady temperature between about 175 and 220 degrees. It's a calcium carbonate formation, and when you look closely at the geyser, you see the different colors in the thermophile. It's some of the uh, oldest life on the planet. I would hope that by coming here and experiencing the beauty of Fly Geyser and Fly Ranch that people are inspired to visit other areas.